sister here. By the time this commercial aired in 1976, Girl Scouts had already been selling cookies for more than 50 years. Today, cookie sales are still going strong, but the commercials look a lot different. Most are homemade, like this video by Georgia's six-year-old Charity Joy Harrison and her dad, Seymour Harrison. Their take on Childish Gambino's Redbone is just one example of how girls have innovated to find cookie customers. Take this story from our media partner, 10 News. New tonight, a Girl Scout cashing in on California's new pot laws, selling hundreds of boxes of cookies outside a local pot shop. Our your Samoa cookie cheesecake. In San Marcos, Troop 1329 digs into a dessert made with their cookies. With the help of adults, the brownies asked chef Brad Hito of Urge Gastro Pub to add a dish to his menu to promote their booth in front of the restaurant. So you have Samoa cookies as the crust, uh, New York cheesecake, and then it's finished with chocolate, caramel, and coconut. Here, let's move these out of the way. Reagan Karg says partnering with a restaurant has become a necessity. Sales outside of grocery stores have slowed. Well, it wasn't that successful as we were here because um, there's more people coming in and they're just like nicer. Here? Mm hmm What are they like at the grocery store? They just don't, like, we like say good morning, they don't respond back. Girl Scouts isn't the only program teaching youth how to innovate in a rapidly changing business world. Schools throughout the county are partnering with industry to walk students through design thinking, basically dreaming up solutions to problems, then testing and marketing their ideas. But there isn't yet much research on whether these programs improve their academic achievement or help students become successful. In, in my world, they're not, we're not really even talking about it. And so. It's exciting to start having that conversation. Researcher Norris Kruger is speaking at a conference on entrepreneurship education at San Diego State next month. He said via Skype, the lack of research, as well as the high failure rate of new businesses, doesn't mean the programs aren't valuable for youth. They know how to do teams. They know how to be resilient to adversity. They embrace uncertainty. They are better connecting the dots. Reagan doesn't use words like resilient or adversity, but here's what she had to say about Girl Scouts. My friends really help me, like, like if I get hurt or something in Girl Scouts, they would always, like, cheer me up. And, like, it's a good feeling. And if I'm, like, making a new company, um, and if, like, someone, um, doesn't get a job or something, I can like give them a job because those friends helped me when I was young. Reagan and her friends will be selling cookies through Sunday. They're giving a portion of their proceeds to a charity that brings therapy dogs to hospitals. The rest will support troop activities. Megan Burks, KPBS News.